Lasagna is generally thought of as a savory dish, but I've got a sweet version that makes a wonderful dessert. We're going to make an apple lasagna. So I've buttered a 9 by 13 glass baking dish, and I've got some store-bought canned apple pie filling that I'll spread across the bottom. And then I'll shingle four no-baked lasagna sheets right across those apples. I took 32 ounces of ricotta cheese and put it in a large bowl along with two eggs. I'm going to add about a quarter cup of sugar and just a dash of almond extract. I'll mix it well and then I'll spread it over that layer of lasagna noodles. Now I'll add another shingled layer of lasagna sheets and then top that with another can of apple pie filling. As soon as I spread that around, I'll make a crumble for the topping. And that consists of about four tablespoons of butter, a quarter cup of quick cooking oats, six tablespoons of brown sugar, some ground cinnamon, and some nutmeg. I'll mix it all together. I'll put it on top of the lasagna, and then I'll bake it in a 350 oven for about a half an hour. I topped my apple lasagna with some fresh whipped cream, but you can try sweet and sour cream or even a dollop of vanilla ice cream. Any way you do it, it's delicious. And the recipe is yours just by writing to me here at the station. Or log on to the website and click on the Kitchen Guy link. I'm Chef Jim. Thanks for watching the tastiest two minutes in television. It's Kitchen Guy, and I'll see you next time.